number 357 mag here. I got another few packages in the mail, so I thought I'd do another man slash prepper toy reveal. And let's see what we got. Yeah, it looks like it's a uh, some kind of sog knife. Oh, it's the Field Pup 1. Check that baby out. I've been getting a lot of uh, folding knife knives lately, and I thought it was time to get a couple of fixed blades because trying to balance out what I have and don't have. Let's we'll take a real quick look at this. And I'd been looking at these for a while. And I wanted something that would balance out. So, yeah, it looks like it's got a nice sheath, nice uh, blade. So let's move on to the next item. Got here. It's a little bigger bag, so let's see what showed up. Another SOG item. I bought two SOGs? Amazing. What could this possibly be? It's a pretty big box. Ah, oh, it's got a large sheath in it. Okay. So, what did I do here? You're making this one hard to get to. And what do we call this? It looks like. Let me check. Ah, oh, it's the SOG Northwest Ranger. I wondered, yeah, that's now I recall. This is another knife. I wanted to get to complement my uh, this had a K bar uh, Mark One, and this is the SOG version of that. It's called the Northwest Ranger, and it's similar in size. Uh, anyway, I'll go into details later. But anyway, looks like two of my SOGs came in, so. It looks like I'll be doing a quick look in those in the future. Anyway, so more toys come in to play with. I'd like to thank you for your time. Have a great day. Oh, one more thing I wanted to do. This is my Kershaw Oso oh Sweet that I had lost and found. And what I wanted to do is to see how, you know, I've been using it for three months. I've been cutting a lot of things up. It, you can see there's goo and crap on the blade. But let's see how sharp it is. It's not as sharp as it was when it came out the box, but, you know, between the cardboard I'm cutting and everything, it looks like it's still doing a pretty good job. I don't know if I can get the real... There you go, look at that. That's not bad for a budget knife. I mean, I only paid $20 for that with shipping and tax, so all I can say is Kershaw makes some pretty fine knives. Okay, remember, long live rock and roll in the American dream. Thank you.